Whoa, 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 if you are looking for a stack 2K account with high overall max badges, well, hit up my man Sports Gaming. His link will be in the description, and make sure you tell him that Steezo sent you, and he will hook you right up. And if you want the process to go a little smoother, DM me too, and let me know that you hit up Sports Gaming and use my name, and I will assist you in helping you to get what you... <laughs> I just want to die. I don't want to try. I don't know why. What up, mother? You know I can't cuss no more, cuz. I'm not even gonna put an instrumental on the end in the background. Because every time I do, I get a copyright strike. And every time I cuss, I get demonetized. So this is what YouTube wants me to do, y'all. Let me get 7K likes. I don't even have this shit written. Whoops. Now I gotta restart it again. What up, y'all? It's Steezo. How y'all doing? Now, today, I'm going to be teaching y'all a new, improved, deadly, the greatest move that I have. This stuff right here is the stuff. This move right here will get you to the promised land. I know, I promised y'all. 7K likes on my old video, and I'll give you the tutorial. Well, here it is, mother... Ah! Now, anywho, this is a move I came up by myself. Matter of fact, all my moves I came up myself, I created. Y'all have to understand. I deserve more credit. I am the greatest. And to all my ISO gods, I know it's not easy. We have a disadvantage in every way. But in a 2K where everyone just does what they can to win, we win. But with style, with skill, even if we lose, we still win. Why? Because we are superior. Last of a dying breed. Hey there, ISO God. I respect you. <laughs> this is all off the top, by the way, freestyle. <laughs> Anywho, the move that we will be learning today is the whoop de whoop whoop de whoop sin. You feel me? All this is right here, and the reason why this move is so deadly, y'all, is because it is the definition of going 0 to 100 real quick. Ain't nobody gonna see it coming. I came up with this move myself, and I know what y'all, won't you teach me the whoop de whoop spin combo 360? You don't need to be doing that. Y'all need to understand the way the game is at this juncture with all the aids, the two centers, the pushing. You do not need to be doing the crazy combos. God damn it. I need to give you shit that's going to help you score. That's going to help you win. These two centers, they're not ready for this. And I'm going to show you why. Because they don't see it coming. As you can see, it happens so quick. The fake behind the back, BAM! Look at me! He wasn't even ready! This is what I'm trying to tell you. This move is crazy. And I know what you're thinking. That didn't look too hard to guard. But there's levels to this stuff. You have to understand. Now watch on this clip right here. He's going to stand back anticipating it this time. Well, now I'm just going to hit him with the whoop de whoop hezzy, and now I got the open three. As you can see, if you start to fall back, then I will just hit you with the crossover to the whoop de whoop hezzy on the other side. Now I have an open shot. There's levels to this. This move is one of my most unguardable moves. You have to understand. You f***ing 
it. <laughs> now look, to do this move approximately, what you need to do. Let me get my controller out and just. All right, now look. What you need to do first is you need to press down on the right analog stick. Now, you need to pay attention to your player because before the ball goes from the left hand to the right hand or the right hand to the left hand, before it makes that full just switch of hands, you need to hold up with the left analog stick and go back to the same ball hand with the right analog stick. So if the ball's in your left hand, you want to press down with the right analog stick and then quickly up with the left analog stick and back left with the right analog stick, like so. And now it needs to be done at a certain timing. See, what y'all need to understand is, and ignore my computer going crazy in the background, it sounds like a jet engine, but what y'all need to understand is, about this dribbling stuff, it's all about timing. Timing and repetition, and the timing on this one is very quick. As you can see, I press down, up, left, all almost at the same time. The only thing that comes first is the down with the right analog stick. So down, boom, boom, and he'll make the animation like so. If it's in the other hand, you press down with the right analog stick, hold up with the left analog stick, and back right. And it has to be quick before the ball switches hands approximately. Now. Once you get that motion down of the fake behind the back, otherwise known as the whoop de whoop whoops in. Oh wait, the whoops in actually comes after this, so it's just the whoop de whoop. After you get that down, what you want to do is, what nobody else ever thought of doing, is after you do the fake behind the back, hold up. Or not even up, I want to say a diagonal up, depending on which side you want to go to. And then do a crossover. And he will do that animation right there. Now I'm using normal four crossover to get the good one. But you don't even need this one. If you use normal three, if you use normal one, you can do it with all of the crossovers. But I like normal four because it gives you this. Now look at that. Boom, fake, boom, crossover. They don't see it coming. This is one of my most deadliest moves to date because it's so simple. If you want a quick bucket, all you have to do is have them lined up. And you know everybody be playing hands up defense nowadays. Well, hands up defense versus this move gets cooked every time, especially with the normal four crossover. They don't see it coming. They think you're doing a regular. Boom, you hit them you, to the basket or you hit them with the fake out. You can go to the side. There it is, y'all. Now, as you can see, it's just amazing. Look at me. I'm not even missing. 7K likes for my jump shot. That's what a slashing shot creator. I'm just not missing. Do y'all want... Let me get 7K likes for a jump shot video. God darn it. This is crazy. I told y'all I got y'all. Ain't nobody in the community on my level when it comes to these moves. I just don't be uploading. But when I do, I got the heat for y'all. I, me, <laughs> but when are y'all gonna fix the gosh darn pushing? Talking about, oh, I need a patch approval, blah, blah, blah. If this thing, if pushing cost y'all money, y'all would have been patched it. Let's be real. You mother suckers is lazy, bruh. I'm tired of not being able to play 2K and have fun. I want to stream. I want to have fun while I play. I want to hit 94 overall. Stop doing this to me. Why did I have to be a 2K YouTuber? Why couldn't I just play Fortnite or something good? Nah, hell no. I am a 2K player. I am a 2K YouTuber. I'm one of the greatest 2K players ever. Why are y'all doing this to me, bruh? I want to enjoy my job. I want to enjoy making videos, but I'm not a sellout. If I don't like playing the game, I just don't play it. But I understand that's not right for my fan base. Y'all still play the game. I don't blame y'all. 2K is 2K. But y'all need to fix y'all issues, bruh. I'm tired of promoting y'all game, and y'all game is trash. And it's not even all the way trash. It's only trash because y'all refuse to patch certain things, bruh. It has so much potential. Every 2K has so much potential. But y'all devs just don't be doing y'all mother... Good job! Damn! 
And now I'm getting my blood pressure all crazy, bro. I, this ain't even like that, bro. I don't got no instrumental on in the back of this video. I don't be cussing, bro. I'm professional. I do my job. Why don't you start doing yours? Ronnie Baluba. Now, anywho, let me get 7K likes. I'll drop a jump shot. You know, I realize I'm being very selfish not uploading because I don't like the game. I still got a fan base. We still got to hit 200K. We still here. Steezo the mother God. You feel me? I love y'all. Have a beautiful day.